That breaking news involves the Army Corps of Engineers. It says it has stopped all navigation on the Arkansas River because of issues with a spillway at the Dardanelle Lock and Dam. Situation began during routine maintenance Tuesday morning. Now, the Corps says it has been in contact with emergency management and the nearby Nuclear One power plant. Navigation from upstream is not expected to resume until repairs are, uh, are completely made. That includes any traffic going down the river from Fort Smith Van Buren. Traffic can still, though, move from the Dardanelle Pool downstream to the Mississippi River. Now, the mayor of Russellville released a message tonight about the situation with the Arkansas Nuclear One plant. Uh, Arkansas Nuclear One is fully aware of this situation. Their teams are equipped for anything like this. So just know that we're monitoring this. Uh, this was not your normal Thursday afternoon update. There is not a situation to worry about. Uh, like say the Corps of Engineers is working on this and we will keep you up to date. Uh, if there's anything that I need to update you with, just kind of wanted to let you know uh, what's going on because there's some things out there on social media and you know how uh, crazy things get on social media sometimes, but just know the Corps of Engineers is working uh, to rectify this situation. We are shutting down boat docks uh, just as a precautionary measure. Everything is, uh, everything's fine. There's no, there's no need to worry about it. The only thing that we could see happen is the lake on the top side could get a little bit lower. We could see that level uh, go down overnight. So that, that's the only thing that we could see happen. So Corps has not provided any timeline for how long repairs could take. Engineers say they believe the gate may be stuck because of friction, because of a heat expansion or mechanical binding. We'll, of course, follow this story and bring you uh, updates throughout the night on Channel 5 and on 5 News Plus.